Hello friends, welcome to programming9.com C programming video tutorials. I am Raj Shekhar, I am your instructor. In this tutorial, we are going to discuss about the basics of constants. What is a constant and what are the different types of constants existing in C programming language. Let us see what are those. <coughs> Right, what to discuss in this session? We simply discuss about a basic constant definition and different types of constants existing in C programming like integer constants, real constants, character constants and string constants. So what is a constant? A constant is a simple value that cannot change during the execution of a program. Right, in the previous session we discussed about a variable. Variable is simply a value that can change during the execution of a program just like variables constants have data types like int float double char etc what is the syntax of declaring constant simply constant we need to write a keyword called const space data type whatever it may be int float double char short int, long int, long long int, whatever it may be. So here we need to mention a variable name. We already discussed about the variable name. Or you can alter this data type to constant position, constant to data type position, like data type space const variable name. These two are completely valid. This is a strictly valid format. You can also define the constants using a define with a hashtag, hash define pi space 3.14 but the condition is we should have to define this variable on the top of the main but here this is you can define any any location in the c programming c program what are the different types of constants in c simply integer constant real constant character constant and string constants we already know the different data types called integer real character and string here the real might be float or double let us see what is an integer constant. C integer constant is a decimal or octal or hexadecimal number. Generally, octal number starts with 0, hexadecimal number starts with 0x. Here, integer constants are always positive. I don't say exactly this is a positive. We can also use the negative values, but you need to specify minus sign. If you don't use any positive or negative sign before the value, automatically it will be considered as positive value. Right? Decimal constants 10, 10, 24, 1, 2, 7, 8, 9, 8, 4, 5. This is the from short range to long range. This is the decimal constant and octal constants, which is very equivalent to 10. 10 is the decimal in octal 0 1 2 in hexadecimal 0 x a similarly 1024 this is an equal constant in octal equal in hexadecimal similarly this number we can also see the example of this integer constants how to define this <coughs> let us see a simple program hash include stdio.h i think this is the very basic program anyone can understand in a simple in a simple way let us see the simple declaration const int a this is a simple declaration i defined a value with 10 this is a decimal representation and of course you can, you can write with octal representation int const b equal to 0 1 2 just observe const int a int const b these two are valid this is octal representation and this is hexadecimal representation if you print these three values the, it gives the same result as 10, 10, 10 as an output. Why? Because I al we already discussed 10 is equal to 0, 1, 2 in octal representation, 0, x, a is in hexadecimal representation. How the computer knows whether it is octal or hexadecimal? Simply place a 0 in before the number, it will be considered as octal. If you place 0, x in before the value, this will be considered as hexadecimal. So, directly it gives an output as 10, 10, 10. What are the real constants? The default form of real constant is double and it must have a decimal point. And real constants can be classified as float and double. The float value and double value. By default, if you declare any number, if you define any number with just like 3.45, it will be double until unless you specify f suffix to this number. 
let us see the simple representation 0 0, 0 is a by default its value is double double here I what I what I have done is minus 6.0 I placed f suffix literal here so automatically it is considering as float we will also see the example to this and I also uh, write a written a number called 3.1415926536 L here so it simply represents the long double in the next constant is character constant character constants must be enclosed within a single quote we use escape character along with the characters generally the characters might be a b c d any of the key on the keyboard but we need to show some kind of variation with those keys so that we for that we use a backslash symbol before that character so it indicates it has some different meaning than the general constants like I just written 0 0 is a constant but if I use something uh, some backslash in before that 0 it indicates that it has some internal meaning in the C simple uh, was we are familiar with a new line right backslash n it represents a new line character similarly vertical tab form feed carriage written single code double code backslash etc string constant string constant is a sequence of characters enclosed in double quotes there is a slight variation between string and a character a character means it's simply enclosed with a single quote but in string constant it is enclosed with double quotes for example double quotes i haven't written anything in between these quotes so it's simply null string so i've written programming 9 in the double quotes it's a string of length 12 characters Similarly, you can also write with the spaces. Space will also be count as an extra character. So, 3 plus 4, 7, 7 plus 1, 8. So, this string consists of 8 characters. This is also a character. Let us see a simple program what we discussed in these slides. Let us see here const int a equal to 10 int const b equal to 0 1 2 0 x a i just printed these three values with the percentage d percentage d percentage d this three represents the integer values so i am executing this the program is successfully executed and it returns an output 10 10 10 simply i used code blocks software here it's a free and open source you can use you can also use this Thank you so much. This is Rashikar signing off programming9.com. Thank you.